Hello people of all faces, my name is Mr. Binoculars and welcome back to Mr. Binoculars Christmas Carol. Get away, get away, stupid fuck. This story is, uh, is one, two, three, and uh, a little over uh, three pages. Three quarter, three and one, three and a quarter. Mm -hmm. Actually, it's three and one fifth. <laughs> Yeah, that's most of it. But yeah. Uh, yeah, it's not that too long. It's like it's about a family who celebrates Christmas in the jungle. Episode 17. Jungle Christmas. No, it's just too young. It's training this. William Grape was climbing in a, climbing a tree in the jungle. His older, bro older brother. His older, older sister, Lila. Lila. Lila and Lila. Lila. Grape was on the ground searching for sticks that they could use for firewood. Their dad, Joseph Grape, was the one who ordered Lila, Lila, Lila to do that. Their mom, Mary Grape, was trying to ignite the fire, while Joseph was trying to get William down. No, I don't want you, William said. Son, you have to, Joseph said. Why, William said. Because I say so, Joseph said. No, William said and continued to climb. What's going on? Lala said as, as she was passing by to deliver the firewood to Mary. Firewood? Seems like this. This is. Wait, wait a second. Um, I do that and keep doing this. Oh no. Yeah, sorry. Uh, yeah, it's like, yeah. <laughs> I love to do it. Uh, you know, I, I don't think I need to do that, but I'll uh, just do that anyway. Um, oh yeah, put this down. William won't come down, Joseph said. Should I climb up and talk to him? Leela asked. No, I can handle this, Joseph said. Okay then, Leela said. Dad? Dad, William said. What is it now? Joseph said. Asked. I think it's about to snow, William said. You can't know that, Joseph said. Yes, but it's very cold right now, Joseph said. Lila ran back to camp to deliver the fi firewood. Um, and uh, checked the calendar that they carved in to the trees the day they got stuck. It was December 24th. Lila ran back. I think it's right, Lila said. Not you too, Joseph said. I checked the calendar, it's December. Lila said. We're gonna come down now, Joseph said. Okay, Dad, William said and climbed down. Sorry, if you're sorry, I'm going to interrupt that. I know I'm going to. 7, 8, 7, 8, 9, 9, 7, 8, 7, 9, 7, 8, 7, 8, 7, 8, 7, 8, 7, 8, 7, 8, 7, 8, 7, 8, 7, 8, 7, 8, 7, 8, 7, 8, 7, 8, had li had gotten life into the campfire. I think we should make our own Christmas decorations, Lila said. Great idea! <laughs> we can use vines. Vines. Vine is dead, but not me too. <laughs> and different colored cur uh, rocks. Cocks, William said. But we don't have any paint, Lila said. Lila said. Who said we have to use paint? William said. Oh, oh, but then we ha only have one color, William said. Yes, but we might get different shades if we can find the right tools, Joseph said. And also ingredient ingredients as well. <laughs> Lila and William would search for vines and rocks, while Mary made some of other Christmas decorations that resembled what the fuck was that? Decorations that resembled the birth, Christmas decorations that resembled the birth of Jesus, and Joseph made some kettles of stick, of some sticks, a kettle of stick, kettles of some sticks. After a few hours, Lila and William finally got enough vines to draw and rocks for decorations, and went back to the campfire, 
When Mary, when Mary and I was still sitting and making small decorations. Mom, where is Dad? William asked. He's out hunting. He'll be back soon, Mary said. Mary wasn't, and Mary wasn't wrong. And I, after a few minutes, Joseph returned. Dad, we found enough stuff, William said. Great. I also, I was also searching for the right equipment while I was hunting. I found it. So now we can make the stones pink and violet. Pink and violet, Joseph said. Pink and violet? Lila said. I found some pink flowers and some violets, Joseph said. Oh, cool, Lila said. Joseph and Lila, Joseph, Lila and William began to become on the paint right away. It didn't take long before they were done. <laughs> I was always joking. Okay. It actually says done. <laughs> now let's begin painting. <laughs> I'm overusing it. Now let's begin painting, Joseph said. Lila and William began painting, on, painting the rocks. They made a paint in large bow, in a large bow, large enough to fit small, uh, one small rock in. They didn't have enough paint to cover all the rocks, but they did cover a few of them. When they were done, they waited until the paint dried, which didn't take long because of the because the paint was made of blood. Then they attached them to the vines. Mary did all most of the work. When she was done, William and Lila began to climb the trees around them and attach the festive vines on top of them. The vines to them, not on top of them, I can't even read. It was uh, already dark when they were done. The family was so happy with what, uh, with that, with what they had accomplished. Ah. It's a, sh a shame we don't have any lights, Lila said. That's re that, that reminds me, Joseph said and walked towards the pl place where they usually stored food. I made these while you were away, Joseph said and gave Lila the homemade candles. Jungle made, or this case, jungle made candles. Will you place these for me? Joseph asked. Sure, Lila said. Can I ignite them? William asked. Be my guest. Be my guest. Be my guest. Joseph said and gave William some flint. Uh, are we like the flint sounds now? William jokingly said. You made that, that that joke too many times now. It's not funny anymore, Joseph said. All right, William said, and ignited the candles. It looked like tiny torches sticking in the ground. Then it began to snow. So they sung a Christmas song. All of a sudden, a jaguar interrupted them. Lila, William, and Mary ran behind Joseph, who grabbed his spear. The jaguar was slowly moving towards them in a slow game. Then the jaguar jumped against Joseph. Towards Joseph, sorry. Uh, Joseph fought it. The fight lasted for around five minutes, but Joseph eventually won and killed it. Then they heard a boat honk in the distance. Joseph, Mary, Lila, and William ran towards the beach. They saw the boat. It was a cruise ship. They waved so hard they could. It worked! The boat was driving towards them. They were welcomed on board, and they got a free ride home on a Christmas cruise. I'm sorry, it got a little bit stupid towards the end. So, uh, yeah, I think I said at the beginning, like it kind of derails after a while. Um, so yeah, if you like this episode, please leave a like, and if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you get notified every single time I upload a new video. And when all light is done, we will meet again next time on the channel. And also, Merry Christmas!